Dear friends, this is Srinivasan who is having more than 30 years experience in the construction industries. Trying to give you a small presentation on building set out using 3-4-5 method. In other words, it is known as a Pythagoras theory. The image will be like this after the leveling and everything. Setting out for a building. Setting out is the process of developing the physical position of the corner of the building and also transferring the dimensions of the layout plan. Setting out clearly defines the outline of the excavation and the center line of the columns and walls so that the construction can be carried out according to the plan. A building set out in order to accurately define the outline width of the excavation and determine the center of the proposed building walls or columns so that the construction can be carried out according to the drawing that is an architectural plan which has been in reality transfer in the ground this building process is called as setting out of the building this central line method of setting out is generally preferred and adopted all over India this is the general images which uh, will explain you how to do the central line out and what all the equipments have been used out etc. Setting out can be very tedious and complex engineering process. Experienced engineer and surveyor who is uh, well conversant with the setting out are required for more accurate transfer of levels and the angles of the setting out. We are now we are going to discuss about the most common setting out method. Setting out using pegging. Setting out using blocks. Error should be avoided because the whole structure is to be built based on the respective set out. While setting out, you must fulfill the following requirements. First is the site clearances. This is the way site clearance has been get it done. In some places you can do it manually also. This is the first thing you have to do before doing the set out. Clear all the obstacles which is coming inside the setting out line so that you can properly do the set out. Proper site clearance is essential for the safety of the workers and other visitors. Obtain the architectural plan for a proper layout. The central line plan. The central plan and line plan will be look like this, which will show you how the foundation to foundation, center to center, and the column where it has been located, etc. etc. This has been available with the architecture and structural consultant. You can obtain it before commencing the set out. These plans to be obtained before starting the set out of the building. The architectural plan will give you an insight on how your building look like and help you in establishing your parallel line. Structural plan will help you in determining the width, depth of the excavation of foundation, wall, etc. and the exact point of the foundation. The structural plan also give an insight on central point of the structural walls and columns. Tools required. Pegs, nails, rope or line, hammer, tape, mallet, making tool, etc. etc. The image of the tools required for a setting the layout has been shown, which you can easily understand. Establish a parallel line as shown below. For establishing the line, you have to have an, uh, another building which I showed as a detached house here. The first thing is to establish is a parallel line. To form a parallel line, there must be an existing building along the proposed structure or a static structure which, can, which will not be removed till the time your plinth has been completed. This also helps you in establishing our reference line. These lines should be offset from the building to prevent any possible 
snagging of the string lines. The line should then be established with the use of a stake at each end and the line should be fixed at each point. Please ensure the line is very tight as this will prevent a false reading if the weather conditions is windy which is shaking the lines. From the, from the diagram above, you know how to establish a parallel line for the detached house. We need two measuring tapes and three peoples. The first tape will be used to measure 7200 mm from edge of the fence to the first point of the house involving two peoples. Refer the diagram please. The third person will hold the second tape at a distance of 6150 mm away from the edge of the fence forming a distance of 3825 from same point of the building. The person holding the second tape must make sure the tapes are in the specified distance then he mark with a peg to form the first point using the 345 method. This is known as the 345 method. The 345 method is an accurate method instead of using the engineering square which may not be accurate for a longer span. The 345 method is an application of the Pythagoras theory. This is way the, how the Pythagoras theory is to be read out has been shown in this image. Establish your profiles. Now we have four pins in the ground establishing the outside of our excavation. The next thing we need now is to set up our profiles. This should be at least one meter away from our four pins. Make sure these extensions are all the same and accurate. You make use of the wooden peg in forming all the extensions. Nail the points of excavation on your profile. Setting out of the EC using the 345 method again shown be here. This is the how the portion of the corner profiles has to be established as explained earlier. Extend the plumb of your lines and mark the line on top of your profile. Put a nail and write in the profile saying something like that outside the excavation or inside the excavation. From this point we can mark the center of our excavation which will also be the center of our structural wall. You know this measurement you can then establish on the profile of actual building line right as the outside structural wall and the inside. Put in a small lines and repeat this on each partition of the building. Put in your lines then excavate where necessary according to the structural drawing and make sure your excavation are leveled properly. Nail the points of column on your profile. This is the methodology of how do you are going to nail the column center on your profile outside which is known as the side rails. Once done with the excavation, the next thing is to remove your line and nail another points to establish columns. If you are using out to out, make sure that you continue till the out to out. In case if you are using in to in, make sure that you follow the in to in till the process has been completed. Using column placements will be there, your lines intercept each other. Make sure you make use of spirit level while placing your column. Thank you for watching this presentation. Kindly subscribe, like and share which will motivate me for further good presentation. In case of any worries, do not hesitate to write to me. The response shall be at the earliest. All the images courtesy of the Google images. Contact me. Civilconclave at the rate of gmail.com or at my telegram group which is known as the Asrini telegram group. The link is as follows. Thank you once again. Kindly subscribe the channel.